in progress. Okay. So what we'll do, this is a little bit chilly and stuff. We'll make sure we oh yeah, well, that's what we've been serving. We don't think much um you've got your feet held with the cart. So you want your toes in line with the knees and your feet parallel, and the parallel can either be completely pointing forward or it can be slightly out to the side, depending on how your legs are sort of stuck on. So, um, yeah, it's all really good. So we relax the shoulders, we lengthen through the spine, the foot floats up, the sitting bones sink down, and we go. Mind. So um, open the shoulders. So once you've got lots of room in your body, so you've got um, the knees, the ankles, the hips, let them through the spine, breathing in and out. Very nice. Feel the air as it goes in. Feel the air as it comes out. <clears throat> We've got another three. Really? Okay, we've got three zoomies and one, two, three, four, five rooms. Fabulous. Yeah, we're just standing at the moment. <laughs> so you want to imagine we'll just have to perch down. On like a high chin, it's like we were perching. So I was in the uh, London Underground yesterday, and they've got these seats near the doors that are quite high up in the perching, where you can perch on them. And uh, yeah, it's a bit like you got you there. So you and the, the hips, your hips, your sitting bones, and your hips go slightly back as well as down. This is the latest thing from, from the head poncho. And then what you want to do is you want to unlock your knees. Unlock your knees. And relax and soften the knee joint. So you want a nice, happy, springy knee joint. And what that does is that forces you to use your leg muscles. And that's how they make it. But then you've got knees that are doing what they're supposed to be because a lot of people wander around with these lots of knees. <laughs> it's just not cool. I was noticing that. I've been, I've been um, working a lot more with musicians and just watching their, especially like piano players. And, all that. and, um, uh, and I just, you know, you know. And soften and the leg thing, and it's all marvellous. So you want your chin, it doesn't want you too far forward. You imagine you're holding a ball that's supposed to be water, and just now you're pushing the rest of it. So it's not sticking out there, but it's also not really pulled back. But you want to keep it enough, so I'll just show you the This part lengthens part of your neck. Lengthens a bit, so you, you feel. There we go. And we're just going to do some loosening, and then we'll do some nice um, <clears throat> warm up joint exercises. And then we'll go through. Uh, yeah, no, that was the room leader. We'll go through the. If you're handy, then it's a great day. Yes, yeah, so about those of that are in the room, I thought it soon. Because of the COVID, we have to have the doors open. We want to increase virus Yeah. Just the airflow yeah. means that they don't fly the past, <laughs> go away. Yeah. Yeah, or if I put it, it's blowing all over this year. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So we're all breathing. 
on knees and then on the toes. So when you're doing this exercise, you want your knees that kind of stay put. They can go towards the back a bit, but definitely no lateral movement with knees. So the it's the waist that's moving. This this is moving. I mean, what are you doing? Yeah, my, my cousin's time was in America for a month, so I've got a text on a work season. I've seen it 26 years. <laughs> so, uh, and the first thing she saw when she arrived in this country was a, a queue of about 200 people waiting for petrol. <laughs> well, she called it gas. <laughs> what's going on? I have to explain it so it's simple. From the Canada and the people being the city and the government. Only just sent the army now. <laughs> so. yeah. So we just want to relax the arms, make you really floppy work. Okay, next we'll do the bounce shake. So this is one I learned from Evan Scuba. Bounce and shake. Yeah, it's bounce enough. I mean, that goes for you zoomies. If you fancy coming along to the 10 o'clock class as well, I, I, can, I can actually open the room. I open the room for 10 o'clock. You can come along and join in. We'll have that work. We'll have to work out. I should turn it or something. Because then actually you could probably fit 20 people there and then there'd still be enough room in this room. Okay, so bounce. Big breathing. Oh, so we'll just do that. So you want to keep your arms in front of the body and make sure your palms are nice and big. Nice big pump, and we're using our we're using our knee pads. Now we've got them all nice and happy by not watching them. So uh, <clears throat> so yeah, so it's the conservative conference. So you'll be seeing lots of examples of poor posture. The one thing with this team they call the Tory Harris It's totally bad, it's really rubbish. Oh, it's, all, it's really not how to. Uh, I should go over and say, no, that's not how you stand. If you want to, can't look. And pull the palms up. So it, it's nice and tall. So you want to open, open the chest. Open the chest. Lovely. Lovely. This should be really good for the ping pong. Ping pong Being able to open the chest. Not quite the it's when most of the time picking the ball up the and missing. They're not good. And you can change one in the front, one behind. It's really floppy fried. Floppy fried glass. Imagine you're moving through water so they're not 100% fascinated with them. They've got, they've got to still have this inherent alertness. So it's a bit like the Tai Chi symbol, you've still got a bit of yak in the yin. So just turn in. It's really good. That's it. Okay. 
shoulder come up, back round and down. Yeah, like those of you on the Zoom, you can have a two hour class if you want. Well, I don't mind. More than the merrier, really. Oh, that's so nice. That's so nice, we can do it in the other direction now. Here we go. <clears throat> Especially the colder the weather gets, the more important it is to make sure your joints are all happy before you're doing exercise. Okay, let's do the bird, hold it to show you that. So you come around and then open that chest up, and then you come around. So the new market roundabout has got those silly ball things on it. So you can imagine you're feeling the well, I'm, quite, like, I'm not sure what to make works so about roundabouts because the thing is, you're supposed to be driving and concentrating on what you're doing because they've got one at Royston as well. And they've got like um, the, the bathroom and stuff going on, some marbles, and you just think, well, oh, hang on a minute. <laughs> And then, oh, that okay. Hang raise its wings. So you turn your hand out, you turn your waist, you just raise the arm, go forward and up, and then it goes over the top, push down, you come. Oh, I'm not the builders. Yeah, I saw a load of guys in high vis jackets. You don't see them very often in this town, do you? <laughs> At the moment, we see them a lot. Oh, you see them a lot. <laughs> they managed a lot of nuts, didn't they? They've got their stuff at home. How about that? They were down that road. <laughs> well, now you were that way. Oh, that was the water thing you can't have, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. and then you come forward to the. Right, back and down. So we just, you just want to relax. You just want to relax when you're. It can be quite tempting to tense up when you're, especially when you're doing something new. So you want to resist that temptation and develop a new temptation of relaxing all the time. Then that's much better. So you're. Come on, everybody. Okay, and then what we'll, we'll do the, um, yeah, let's do this. So we stretch up, we make a fist, we turn the fist over, and we stretch down. And then we come up, down, come up. And down. I can't be your stuff on Zoom. Uh, 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 uh,
Then you come back, so put it back where you found it, so nice and upright. So, you know, always put things away where you found them. Then you won't lose anything. Very useful. Same with your body. Put your body where you stand. <laughs> so you want to, there we go. Mod. That was so good. I'm doing one more week's time. Very good. Everyone's following. And our knees are happy because they're in love with our toes, aren't they? Brilliant. It takes a seat a demonstration. So you want to get into your best regal frame of mind. And then the hands come forward. And as the hands come forward, the hips go back and you lengthen through the spine. So this bit goes up, this bit goes down, and then this bit goes forward. I shall go from the diagonal view. So we go like this, and then we come up. Now, when Eva does it, she goes into a full squat, but I've got nothing to prove. So I'm just doing it like this, and that's still. So when you, when you go like that, you want to still peering over your specs, and you're keeping your chin in line as well. It can be tempting to chin it up. But don't resist that temptation. You don't have a new temptation, you have a correct posture. That's a much better temptation. Yeah. Character building, isn't it? Let's do one more. Well, right, I think we've got enough character now. Fabulous. Okay. <clears throat> done that, we've done that, we've done that, we've done that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Let's. So remember, when you hear a sound, check your posture. So uh, that Bill just very kindly started using the pneumatic drills. Basically, you're wondering what that noise is. Okay, now we go around in the other direction. Very good. Okay, bring the feet together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, on the way. One, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Go to the turn away. So you're just transferring from one foot to the other. We're nice and tall. We're relaxing around the jaw. We're relaxing the muscles in. And sinking, the bones are subtle feeling and bones in your supporting them. Right. Okay, now we're going to cat stance and then we're going to turn the knee outwards. One, two, three, four. Oh, so that works for me, the um, ankle and the hips. Seven, eight. So now we do eight circles going inwards. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. There's a much more horrible version of it. It's not a little bit of a So go nice and tall, get your best posture, and we go out. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and then inwards. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Thank you. And we'll do the I'll do closer circles. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Out of the way. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. This is silly. One, two, three, four, five. So those are the silly ones at the moment. So eight and then out. It's one, two, three, <coughs> five, six, seven, eight. Inwards. Six, seven, eight, forward roll. Two, four, six, seven, eight, backwards. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, over and under. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then one, 
And then one more time. <clears throat> and then raise the arms. See, um, open the chest. Sorry. Raise the arms and then I open the chest. Up, down, that's it. And I'll show that comes up. And then you come down. And then you come up. Chest. This is nice. I really like this. It's just so lovely. One more time, beautiful. But check your posture momentarily. If it's just so, and then raise the palms up. And then wave the rainbow, dance the rainbow. Really like this move. So you look at the hand on the side. And turn your head so it gives your neck a bit of an exercise as well. And you keep your arms up. That's it. With nice round shape in the arms. But well, completely lost count now. Let's do one more week, really sorry. Fabulous. And then let the arms come down. Feel the arms. Hanging, check your posture, and then we'll do parting the clouds. We'll part the clouds. Oh, lovely. And then come down, come up, down, up. Keep breathing some more. <laughs> so you're the soft and light. Nice. Okay, let's do one more thing. That's really good, everybody. Let the arms hang by the side. We're going to do rolling arms. To show that little diagonal for the, for the video. So you turn the waist, you open the, um, the hands, bring the hands to the side of the head, push forward as you pull back. So eventually you come to move, circular movement with both hands. <clears throat> Well, this music you can hear now, this is a video. I'll put it up on Facebook. There's a swan, it's swan courtship dance music. It's a couple of swans doing their courtship dance, but Nick Penny recorded. I mean, put this music to it. I love music swans. So, and right, what we're doing up there. So <clears throat> yeah, and it is interesting in watching a video of swans courting with this last music. Send me an email and I'll send you the video. Yeah, that's that'll do. Yeah, just 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 join in. We'll, we'll look at detail when we're less um watch. We can join in and it's still very good. Okay, and then just relax. And then bring the hands up. That one's a bit tricky now. We'll, we'll have a pick of the pot's tricky movements. 
next week so we will have them to sit. But are we all free? Very good. Oh, okay. That was so good. We'll do one more. And here we go. When, when the professor does it, he goes quite low. He goes down quite low, but we don't have to. And this is really hard to do. Fall off in front of the shoulder, and then we're looking as if you were looking off the crowd on a big ship. This is gaze. One more time each side, that would be useful, everybody. Then now we're going to do how this is the move. So you just both hands together, and then it kind of comes up like that, like you're throwing something. Over your shoulder, like a little petrol can. So, there isn't any. So, it's, it's in Scotland, it's in the north, but it's not in the south east. So, we have to look about. So you want to just use you move the movement is soft, smooth, and slow. Soft, smooth, and slow. One more time each side. Check the build the ground on your feet. So your feet parallel, knees and toes pointing in the same direction. Your hips sinking back and down slightly. Your legs moving through the spine. Your chin is resting on the small ball. With your eyes broken or closed, you're softly gazing forward and you're lifting behind and above. So you've got this real awareness and also a sort of special feeling of clarity and calmness. Very kind of peaceful, clear place. So now what we're going to do is we're going to do the um, cushion palm. So you come round. So it's like coming round and then back again. Uh, I really like this little twizzle he does with his hand. Very good. It's a bit kind of our old river, I see. I can't really remember what happened. I'm not really watching it again. I think it's probably still going. It's probably all this time, I think. Brilliant. One more time each side. Okay, and then bring the hand around. So you put the outside of the arm outwards, and the inside of the arm pushes towards your chair. This hand makes a fall underneath, and you transfer your weight, you turn the weight and the hands around. You transfer the weight, you turn the weight. Pretty big. There we go. Yeah. 
So we'll do one more time each side. That isn't bad, everybody. Very good. And then, okay, now I'm going to do it along the diagonal because uh, you can see more of my arms and legs. But you go to the front. <clears throat> I'm going to put it on the floor. I'm going to do two of the sea and the half of the scarf. And down we go. Two of the sea and the half of the scarf. So, I've got my colleagues at the orange book. She brings in servants on it every morning at 6 p.m. I need to do that because this is what she does. She's a sweet little girl, she's lovely, right in the middle of five o'clock. She even invited us, she invited the Norwegians. If you fancy coming for a nice wild swim, at six in the morning in freezing cold water in absolute London. How many went? I think it was just fun. Sitting in bed, stuck. No, nice and snug in bed. That's brilliant. But I think that works. So if we stood it up, that would be river water. One more time. And then we change the change size. So you want to make sure you've got you've got your forward and back thing going on. So you've got the nice sort of um it's a longer scarf, so it's still you've still got your shoulder width gap so that if you go too narrow, it's a bit of a tight one. Whereas you have a nice wide imagine you're standing with a big rectangle, you've got a little bit more room and you can balance in it. So we come back. Look the sea and look up at the sky. So next time you're in the beach, especially at the Bahamas, I wouldn't recommend North, but you can do this for real. I did actually do a load, of, I did pushing waves in the sea in Cornwall. It was really cold because I thought, because apparently you can do Tai Chi if you move the water, but what I found was waves kept causing me to lose my footing and <laughs> Because it really was, it was quite cool doing it through water. But I, I think it wasn't meant to be taken literally, I found with experience. So there we go. We'll do one more. It's a good workout, isn't it? Okay, but then we do different ways, and you're doing that with your feet. So the toes come up and the heels come up, we get the angular action. Back. Okay. Forward and we'll do that little. Lovely. One more. Use. Now do that on the other side. So take a little time to get more posture. Just so again, I'll demonstrate that from the diagonal that you keep proving so. Afterwards, and And then we put the original forward again, and then we'll do pinion spread forward, flying pigeons. 
They have loads of pigeons in this part of Cambridgeshire, so you've got lots to be inspired from. It's obviously not a race with a pigeon, but it's going up and down. Most of the pigeons go up. And then try that on the other side. So get your feet flat spots first. That's it. So you've got a nice wide gap between your heels. You'll be showing the gap that's still happening between your heels. I'll bring, I'll bring the tape measure next week and then we come forwards. We're breathing. You want to feel the chest open. Feel the chest open. Well, and everything's very light and soft. Everything's very light and soft, nice and relaxed. All we good. One more time, Mars. Okay, let me come back. So nice and tall. Bring it down, take your hips, then we'll bring the spine again. Hit side to go back and then punch in the focus. Come a bit closer to the computer people, show it from the side. So we go like this. Boys, we've got our sleeve tight eye gaze. One more each side. The arms relax. Take the hips slightly bend the knees, then come up. Flying wild goose. So this time we hear you've got all the heat coming over. Brilliant. Really good. Yeah, I hope it's going to well be soon. The, the wet ass uh, all the swans there as well. One more time, and then take a slightly wider start. Go to the tall back, so you ground shape in the arms first. Breathing, and then transfer weight, turn. Okay, let's come in direction. Thank you. 
And then we will be soon young today, right down together, and calling the faith. This calling to Master Chun helps you to look younger. You will you? He didn't say by how much, at least a second, don't you think? <laughs> um, 
and then rub the hands together again, and then we're going to have to do the lower back. Oh, that's so much. Oh, thank you. Brilliant. So, nice and cool. I'll just breathe in. Breathe in. Race the tide, return to the mouth. One more time. So just feel like you've got lots of room in your body. You're doggedly connected to the ground, feeling very centered and comfortable and relaxed. And then make a fist with the right hand, left hand out of your top, bring your feet together and back. Brilliant. We've got there. Oh, I'll start the video. 